Oh, you want a nice cold boner? Oh, if you're offering, the heck yeah, man. That'd be great. It's still cold, man. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Because the tree telling me to switch to the inline spinner. I haven't fished like this in a lot. That's got to be a small mouth. What's going on YouTube? How are you guys doing today? My name is Mike and today we are going fishing and we are going fishing on the river. I've been wanting to do this for a while because uh, I miss the river but uh, yeah we're here and uh, I think you guys are going to enjoy this one. Pretty crazy stuff happens. How's it going? Yeah. That looks comfy. Oh, yeah, man. Look, the the it's a chiver. It's a chiver. <laughs> They're usually just floating by, not chilling. I know, we're talking about developing a chiver tear, specialized chiver tear. You can have everything you want on it. Just throw it at them. Oh, I just decided to try a swim bait today, a little. A little small swim bait, boot tail. Yeah. I, I've been using number two, number three mepses just just because the old school gold ones from like. Oh yeah, yeah. I just I mean they're fine, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I actually did catch one down there, um, down on the other side on Indian, and I caught. I mean this was like last fall. And it was just, she was beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. 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 Steely. Oh, steely. Now are you gonna walk up to the bridge? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting waders there. They have very cold boots. Yeah, it's uh, they're frog togs, just like boots are built yeah, yeah, in yeah. whatever. So. Wow, so you have good protection against storms. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you got your GoPro and everything in here. Uh, yeah. I do YouTube and everything. So. Uh, you got a channel? Yeah. It's uh, Mike goes fishing. Yep. All right. So. All right. I'm, I'm Jim. This is Doug. Jim, Doug. Uh, nice to meet you. Mike. I like the Orvis pouch for the uh, for, for your demos. Mm-hmm. This is a good backpack. Hey, you want a nice cold boner? Oh, if you're offering, heck yeah, man. That'd be great. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm, I'm going to try, you know. Even if I don't, it's so nice. It's so nice today. the outside of the bends and shady Yep. Yep, you go to the far side there and just go. Oh, mm -hmm. You stalk them. Smallmouth. There's tons of smallmouth up there. Yeah, I've heard that. I never go after this. Yep. You yep. said, oh, they love streamers. Oh, yeah, they do. They bait fish imitation. They're still cold, man. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Centennial IP. Uh, I really appreciate that, man. Oh, yeah, man. You got it. Look, that was our original. I got more in the cooler. I got my Yeti over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Definitely. You got to have a cold one out in the river. Like yep. That. You need a you need a little a special compartment. A little. Yeah. I think they make them. I got to look <laughs> online. <Yeah. laughs> so. Mike, I'm gonna check out your YouTube channel, man. Awesome. Right on, Mike. Kick ass, Mike. I, I appreciate this. I'll see you guys later you if you're still it, here. Sounds good. Thank you. Man, these guys are so cool. They give me an IPA, Founders IPA. That's awesome. Cool dude. Hopefully, he does find me on YouTube. He comes subscribing. See all the adventures. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna drink that later. So now we're gonna get down this hole, do some fishing. Hopefully we catch something. I knew coming down the river today would be a good day. I'm stoked about that. That's cool. That's the kind of interaction you want on the, on the water. There's too much negativity in the world, and that is just perfect. That's actually like the first interaction I've had like that. That's cool. See if we can't get any fish to eat today. I hope so. It is hot. So we'll probably be up in the shade over here. Might need to switch to that inline spinner though. Oh, we're already in the tree. I think we broke off there. 
That was the tree telling me to switch to the inline spinner. All right. All right, all right, all right. Switch to the gold spinner. See if there's anything in here. This is the eighth ounce Johnson Minnow Spin. These are my favorite inline spinners. I haven't fished like this in a while. That's gotta be a small mouth. Oh, okay. Not huge, but good for small mouth. He's still wanting to fight like incredibly hard. I probably really don't need the net. <laughs> Come here, buddy. We'll just boat flip him. Whoa, spinning, spinning. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Switch the spinner. Got a small mile. If we can get the dang spin out of there. Grab the hemostat. <laughs> Thank you. Not bad. Alright. Let's release this guy. <laughs> Splash the camera. Alright, what I did there was just toss it up near the edge and rolled it on through. There's actually some heavy metals in the water because it's all stuck to my magnet. That's good. <laughs> yeah. He's sitting in that deep pool. He's still fired up. I gotta loosen up my drag so I can fight these fish a little bit more. But yeah, I'm like Johnson Gold Minnow Spin. I'll show you guys that. It actually looks like a minnow. Okay. Get back in there. I don't think I went deep enough that time. The waterlands really help uh, you see what's going on down there. Especially when it comes to water depths. You guys want to check those out? I got a recent update on the discount code. You can use code MGF15 and save 15% off. Get yourself some amazing sunglasses. Designed by anglers for anglers. I got hit by a fish. Oh, no, there he is. That's a rock bass. Species number two, rock bass. These guys are feisty and they're all over the river. See you later, buddy. So yeah, I'm just targeting the shaded areas since the water's low, it's hot out. We'll fish this pool for quite a while. Oh, getting nailed. I need to tighten the drag. That was a good one. It's probably still in there. Be careful, this thing casts so well. Man, that felt like a good thump. Come on, man, I want that one. Hoping for a trout. I haven't caught a trout in a while. Seem to be right on the edge of this bend. Oh, I got nailed again. See, come back for it. Yep. Oh, jeez. What is this? That's another smallmouth. <laughs> Just little guys today, but hey. Get up here, buddy. He's fired up. He's about he's about the same size as the other one. If he is the other one, I'm gonna be pissed. Like, what are you doing? But I'll accept a fight again, man. 
You want to come back each time? Be my guest. Okay, what kind of situation did he get us in here? Get the pliers out. There. Jeez, buddy. Pliers back. Beautiful small now. See if he freaks out. I didn't get the camera wet this time. Ha <laughs> Okay. Well, let's do that again. This is one of the deepest pools. So I have to imagine they're pretty stacked up in here. I don't know if that was rock or no fish. I want a big one. I know they're in here. It's cool because when they're really aggressive, they'll, they'll chase it down. That's a weird cast. Wanted it a bit farther, but oh well. Oh, that was so close to being stuck on a stick. Ah, that's a good spot. Oh. That'd have been a little guy. In the center more. Come on, man. There's one. It's not strong fighting, so I think this is a rock bass. Another one of the same size. We need to like up the caliber here. Little rock bass. Yay! Terrible cast. Oh, yeah, it's getting hit by like little tiny um, juvenile trout. I've never seen them, I've never been able to identify them before until I had these water lands on. Oh, that, there it goes again. Yeah, these juvenile trout want this bad. I think there's a whole pot of them over there. Gotta be all big somewhere in here. That's a fish. I think that's a trout. No, nope, that's a very angry smallmouth. Oh, he's listening to that drag. Man. That's a better, that's a better one. I knew there'd be something deep in there. Come on, man. Oh. These fish just fight so hard. I love fishing the river. <sighs> Boat flip. Oh, that could have been bad. Get him unhooked. A little bit better one right there, I'd say. Nice little smallie. And there he goes. 
Against my better judgment, I'm not retired. Ooh, that went a little farther than I wanted it to. This is probably still get hit. So if you make a back cast in the river, just, just still reel it in anyway. Treat it like an old cast. You'll probably end up catching something. It's hard to leave this spot. But we will eventually. It's just so shaded. It's, it's a deep pool. It's ideal. Next time I'm going to have to come out here fly fishing with some streamers. Get on some smallmouth that way. If you want to see some real fights, that's uh, that's when it happens. There's a long rod. There's a small fish. What is that? Oh, it came off. I think it was a trout. Like a little fingerling. Dang, that would've been cool to see. I brought the net just for them because it's hot out. They're gonna be stressed. I wanna get, get them off the hooks immediately. Are there any more fish? I haven't casted right there. Should be a fish over there. There's one. I think it's another rock bass. Yep. He's got kind of different colorations. I don't know if he's just changing colors. That's what river fish tend to do when they get stressed or angry. But look at that. See you there. The speedo on my GoPro. I could have been nicer to that fish. My apologies. It's hot out. Already stressing them out. That's a rock bass up here. I'm not complaining though. It's fun to catch fish on this. This is actually a medium. Just these uh, river fish, they fight so hard. This is what I'll do when it's really hot in summer and I just don't think the bass fishing is going to be any good. So the river is always colder water. By a lot. What the heck is that on? Some grass. Oh, under the bridge we go. And up here. Oh. Cross the boulders. See if there's any fish. Actually, there's a bass right there, a big one. Actually, that looks, kind of looks like a trout. Oh, I've never, never been able to see them like this until I got these water lamps. This is insane. Oh, yeah, there it was. Let's try that again. I'm sitting in direct sunlight. To me, that looked like a trout. A big one. I got whatever it is. This feels like a trout. Every time I say that, it's a small mouth. It's a small mouth. It's a little small mouth. That was not the fish. My gosh, it's micro. I can barely lip them. This is last year's bunch. Actually, how fast do they grow? This could be this year's bunch. Don't hook me. Okay, little buddy. Get you in the water. I know it's hot. There he goes. I've actually got some bent hooks from these smallmouth just dogging me. That's the thing about these uh, Johnson minnow spins. Their hooks are crap. So if you want to, you could switch them out, but I usually just bend them back. 
I keep I pay attention and I'll bend them back. Let's see if we can get that bigger fish. It's in here. All we have to do is get this drift right. I'm really slowing it down. Oh, there's a fish underneath that rock. Okay. Shoot, right in front of me. Die. That was crazy. Let's do that again. Come on, buddy. I gotta get this drifting right. Let's cast up there. When it comes to rivers, it's all about getting the drift right. Oh, he came out and got it. It's a rock bass. Uh, not a bad one either. Not a bad one. I could technically keep these rock bass. They're panfish, so but he's got some weird shit on his tail. Look at that. Ew. See ya. It's been like 20 minutes, so. Maybe there's some new fish in here. Looks like we're only gonna get one decent size smallmouth today. Sorry, guys. <laughs> bunch of bunch of dinkers. Hopefully, you guys just like the river fishing. If you do, leave a comment down below. Hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. I know I love the river fishing. It's my favorite thing to do. I just I haven't been doing it a lot, and I think I'm gonna make a change. Come here more often. Starting today. <laughs> What's going on, YouTube? We are done for the day. I'm gonna take a break, drink that beer that the uh, gentleman over there was so kindly to give me. Those guys were cool, and uh, they said they're gonna check out the channel. We'll see. If not, that's still a cool experience. I really appreciate that, um, and that's how the encounters on the water should be very positive and. No, there's too much negativity in the world, too much elitism on the river. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. If you did, leave a like and leave a comment. Tell me what you liked and what you didn't like. And if you want to see more river fishing videos. Anyway, don't forget to hit subscribe and don't forget to explore for fish, whether that's fishing new spots or fishing new lures like we did today.